Hey everyone, welcome to day 16 of Monkey Month. Today we're going over a really, really awesome progression for the pull-up, and it is a toenail pull-up. This is a great way for you to scale the movement for the athlete, but still develop strength to do a real pull-up. Here's what it looks like. So one of the first things we want to do is when we set up the bar, we want to have it so that when the athlete's toes, when the athlete's standing on their toes, their chin is actually over the bar. So this actually mimics the pull-up. Now you notice when Nicole gets into her setup position, she's going to put her feet directly under the bar and she's on her toes. She's supported by her toes, but still in her hollow body position. As she pulls, she's going to bring her shoulder blades down and back and initiate the pull and she's supporting herself on her toes, giving herself a little bit of assistance, but she can monitor and she can control how much assistance she gives herself. And then comes back down with control to the point where the elbows are locked out and she's resting on her toes. If you're one of those people that's really struggling with getting a pull-up, we recommend that you do these at least three times a week. Try to get in about 10 reps. If you can do three sets of 10 every other day, I think that'll be really, really helpful in developing a strict pull-up. Would you agree with that? Yes, and anytime it shows up in a workout. Exactly what I was just going to say. That is another option that you have that is great. Use that as a scaling option instead of using a band because you'll be stuck with the band forever. Go ahead and use these for your pull-up whenever it shows up in the workout and have fun. I'll see you guys tomorrow.